Let us continue our lesson about histogram or drawing the frequency density. It is called histogram if we have equal intervals. If we have unequal intervals, we usually call this one frequency density. Now, this one is paper 42, March 2022, number 5B. So the problem is, Iraj draws a histogram to show the information, this information here. He makes the height of the first bar, this one, 17.2 centimeters. Calculate the height of each of the remaining bars. So the height of this bar, first bar is 17.2 centimeters here. Then we are going to calculate only, not to really plot, but in order to understand how to find the height, we need to graph. This one is the mass in grams here, and we have the height here. So the height of the first bar, 0 to 50, we have 0 to 50 is here. So the height is 17.2, estimate. 4, 8, 12, 16. So, somewhere here. So, this is the height. And this is our reference. This block here is our reference. Now, we can see here that this is a rectangle. So, let's find the area of this rectangle. So, the area of this rectangle is equal to the base, which is 50 times the height. That's the area. And that is equivalent to 43. So the formula is frequency here is to the area of the rectangle. Area of the rectangle. And we are going to use this one for computing the rest of the remaining bars and that will be just a simple ratio and proportion so the frequency of the first bar is 43 43 over area of the rectangle which is 50 times the height which is 17.2 so this one is 43 and 50 times 17.2 is 860 okay simplifying this we divide this by 43 we divide this by 43 and we have 1 over 20 so we will use this one to get the height of the remaining bars 1 over 20 remember this one is area of the bars so let's have the second one 31 okay a let's put 1 over 20 What is this one? This one is the frequency, and the frequency is 31. What would be the area of this one? It is equal to 100 minus 50 is 50 times how high? This one, second one, 50 to 100, 100 minus 50, so this one is 50 times the height, that's the area of the rectangle, remember this one, so we have height, this one is the area, this one is the area of the first bar, this one is the area of the second bar, here, and the frequency is 31, and then we cross multiply, so here we have 58 times 1 is 58 times 1, is equal to 20 times 31 so I'm going to put it 20 times 31 and 58 is equal to 20 times 31 is 600 
20 divided by 50 by 50 also here and our age here is 12.4 centimeters that's the height of the second bar so we have 12.4 centimeters what about the third bar so 100 and 200 again we use the one over 20 one for frequency the 20 is area of the rectangle is equal to frequency of 25 here over 1 200 minus 100 is 100 so 100 that is the base here that's the base times how high times h this one is the area of the rectangle Okay, cross multiply 108 times 1 there is 108 is equal to 20 times 25. 20 times 25. Then 108 is equal to 20 times 25 is 500 divided by 100 divided by 100 cancel and h here is equal to 5 centimeters so this one is 5 centimeters the third bar and then the last bar is this one we use again that one over 20 so we have 1 over 20 is equal now to the frequency which is 21 over 500 minus 200 is 300 this one uh, 200 to 500 that's the base of the rectangle times the height so we have 300 times we cross multiply so we have 308 and then it's equal to 20 times 21 so we have 300 H is equal to 420 and then divided by 300 divided by 300 and H is equal to 1.4 centimeters so these are the answers here 1, 2 and 3 so this one is 1.4 here if you add it to graph is not in the problem it's finished already there so 50 to 100 50 to 100 this bar here is 12.4 so more or less here here okay yeah and then 100 to 200 this one here the height is 5 4 so we have here, okay. this is for the third bar and for the last bar which has a height of 1.4 cm so we have 200 to 500 this one is 2 this one is 1 more or less here so here and this is the last bar so this is called frequency density or histogram.